What's going on YouTube? Sniper for Dom fans and all you big, big, sexy supporters out there. My name is Drunk as Shit, and my friends got me hammered. So, my name is Derek. My birthday's trip. It's my birthday. My birthday trip. It's my it's my birthday. And uh, going to Ocean City, Maryland. Pretty, pretty damn excited. Um, not sure what's going to be open for everything that's going on with Corona and stuff. But I'm excited to be on the beach and have some drinks. And uh, maybe show you guys some cool stuff. So don't forget to smash that like button. Leave a comment down below if you have any questions and uh, enjoy this video. And hopefully I'm woke up the next time you guys see me. Yo, good morning, good morning, good morning. Uh, we're about two hours away from Ocean City right now. Shell took the first shift. She's out here looking like she's trying to hide from the paparazzi or something. And then uh, I took over for about four hours, two hours away. Pretty excited to get there. Um, not sure what's all going to happen in this vlog. We have no idea what's all open. Definitely the beach. Definitely drinking and eating some good food. What else? Any, any other cool things? No, nope, just those. Drunken beach. Mm. And me walking around naked. That's probably what's going to happen. That's probably what's going to happen. So can't wait to see the water, man. I'm excited. Okay, so we just got to the hotel. We're staying at the Grand Hotel. Um, it looks like it should be pretty nice. I'm pretty sure Shelly got us a room to see the water. Uh, from the pictures, the room looked nice. Uh, from the outside, I mean, it just looks like a normal beach kind of uh, hotel. I'm hungry, tired, I need a shower. I'm not sure if I'm gonna shower or not. Might go to the beach right off the rip get something to drink get some drinks in me you know so well let's find out what this looks like what um, she just told me that there's a liquor store right across the street from us so that's convenient See what the room looks like. It's definitely old school for sure. We're not used to staying in old school, but down here it didn't look like there was anything. I mean, it's nice in here. It's just it is kind of cool that there's a little kitchen right there, though. Mm -hmm. Beds, little table over there. 
nice view. Not bad at all. How's this damn thing open here? How's it open? How's it open? There we go. Oh yeah. It's a nice view of things. Is that for the restaurant down there? I believe so. Hmm. Pool down there. Got the bay view. The beach is literally right behind us. Just probably, I don't know, four or 500 feet, if that. It's right, right behind us, so that's pretty cool. But uh, yeah, the price on the room wasn't bad. It was like, what, 129 or something like that a night? Yeah. It wasn't bad. Is your boy looking rough as thick. I might take a shower. I wasn't going to, but we'll see. All right, so I feel a little bit better. I was just tired. Eight hours. I mean, it's not that bad, but it still gets to you enough. Uh, we're going to go eat some lunch and get some drinks. And then uh, go back to the hotel and go right out the door to the uh, to the beach. Um, what's that place we're going to? Fishtails. We're going to Fishtails. And then I think we're coming here uh, for dinner tonight. And this place is called Phillips Crab House. I'm a huge crab cake fan if you have no clue. Like, love them. My favorite thing ever. So we shall see how this lunch is going to be. Alright, so first place that we're at. Uh, Fishtails. It's, it's a... Uh, Seems all right. The menu looked good, a little pricey, but I'm sure it's good food. It's fresh seafood, so. How cool is that over there, though? See those things, those tiki bars? They're floats. You can go out there in the water with a uh, with a bartender, and um, look at this bird, just chilling. Uh, but you can go out there and just float around. You got to bring your own alcohol. It's like 60 bucks a person, I guess. But uh, you just go out there, float and chill it's pretty dope i'll update you guys on the food soon all right so the food's here the view and vibe is gorgeous right here it's right across the street from my hotel i got shrimp tacos shelly got shrimp and fries Let's see what it tastes like okay so final verdict definitely come here for like ambiance and maybe to get some drinks we both had seafood. She had seafood uh, chowder, and then she had uh, shrimp and fries, and I had the shrimp tacos. Mediocre for the price. Um, all the shrimp and everything was overcooked. Now, it is COVID. It could be off season as well, since it's September. But uh, other than that, it's a very cool, very cool spot. Um, super cool spot, right? Mm -hmm. Just, I'm sure I would. I wouldn't get seafood here. I would try like maybe a burger or a sandwich from here if uh, if I ever come back. Okay, so there's like a pizzeria and stuff inside the hotel. We just got back from eating. Like I said, mediocre, unfortunately. Cool vibe though. And then when you walk out the hotel, right there's the water and a boardwalk that goes all the way down. It's huge. And we got ice cream in our <laughs> Gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous beach. There's a hotel right over there. And then right here is the water. Super, super cool. The water is cold, too. It's like maybe, I don't know, 75 degrees uh, today. 76, maybe. Sunny. Feels nice. Uh, but a little... Water's a little chilly. And there's not many people in it. Okay, so we just chilled at the beach for a little bit. I did a live stream on Twitch. Don't forget, we're coming up on 95,000 followers on Twitch, twitch.tv forward slash sniping for Dom. Uh, tomorrow, I'm pretty excited. We're gonna be doing a live stream from Secrets over on the Twitch channel, but that'll already, by the time you see this, 
that would already be done uh but if you've not followed me over there make sure you do we're gonna go try out this phillips place looks like an old uh old german building um food's supposed to be good i guess it's a buffet but they may have it closed off and you have to order food but i'm looking for the perfect crab cake so we should see so it is not open Okay, thank you. Yeah, no We're hoping that this is a better meal than our lunch. So this is right across the street from our uh, hotel room. Uh, it's called Phillips. It's usually buffet style and I hear that it's decent. So um, I guess they're supposed to have good, I got their crab cakes. Joey got fried chicken, hush puppies, potatoes, and corn. It looks pretty damn good. Um, prices are still tiny high, not as bad as what I thought they would be, um, but if the food's good, I'm cool with it, so verdict soon. So verdict is, uh, it was, for me, it was better than what we had for lunch. We hear that their buffet is fantastic and this place is packed in the summertime during, uh, you know, when they're busy. So the crab cake, really good, Su suggest the crab cake. It's the first one I've had so far here, um, but it didn't disappoint me. What do you think? Um, this piece is better than the other piece. Yeah. I feel like it could needs use more seasoning. seasoning. Yeah, maybe like some Old Bay or something like that in there. Definitely pepper, maybe some cayenne or something. But the food's decent. Way better than yeah. Hush puppies are pretty good. Yeah, the hush puppies are pretty banging. Okay, so we just finished dinner, and uh, it's probably, I don't know, what do you think? It says it's 75, but it's kind of windy, feels nice, clean air. We're out on the boardwalk. Um, Ocean City, y'all need to step, step up your food game. <laughs> like, like y'all are right here, you know? Like it's, what, what are y'all doing? What are y'all doing with the food? Shit. But uh, tomorrow, hopefully, we're gonna go to Secrets, which is a uh, pretty big party bar. Uh, we're gonna go early though, and uh, get hammered and do a live stream. Looking forward to that. Shell's getting hammered, mm -hmm. hammered, hammered. Mm -hmm. She's gonna poop her pants. And uh, we're gonna enjoy the night. We're both really tired. We still haven't really slept. We're gonna walk the beach for a little bit, enjoy the night. I'm gonna go home, sit on the patio, and uh, crack a beer, and then go to bed and get up early for the sunrise, which you guys will see. Pretty excited. Okay, so I kinda need to share this. It's just really gorgeous. Uh, so we just got back. We're chilling out on the, the patio. It's pretty sweet. Um, really nice view. It's not dark yet, but the sun's starting to go down. Look how gorgeous that is, man. Got to watch it go. It's stuck behind some clouds now, but what a pretty, pretty view for a bay view. I'm more of a big fan. Like, beaches, I love beaches. Huge fan. But I want to be sitting on them. But to look at something, I want a bay view. And that's why. It's, that's just fucking, that's just gorgeous. I guess there's a whole bunch of kids that are coming in tonight and tomorrow, like, 50,000 people or something like that. All these kids that race like GTRs and stuff. And the cops are being really dickish. Well, not dickish. I mean, it makes sense. Um, they are racing all their cars and stuff like that. And they have signs everywhere that says if you're from here from the 22nd through the 27th, that if you go over 30 miles an hour, you'll be arrested on the, on the main road and uh or you know if they're fucking around and doing dumb shit i've seen like 
eight, nine cars get pulled over already in the 15 minutes that I've been sitting out here. So pretty crazy. But I guess like they last year they shut down like highways. Like these kids just blocked highways off and just that, so their buddies could race on the highway as fast as they could. It's pretty crazy. So I get why the cops are doing what they're doing. But uh, getting ready to go to bed, man. Make it an early night. It's 6.55. Enjoying this view for a few minutes. Crashing out. Got a long day tomorrow. Some drinking to do. We're here at Secrets. Uh, supposed to be some big old party place. It's daytime and as soon as they're opening and off season. So me and Shell's about to do a drinking live stream. They have their own distillery and stuff like that. And uh, I guess it's like right on the beach and everything. But a lot of people said to definitely come here. So we are, uh, we're going to give it a go. Hopefully the live stream's gonna be lit. We'll see how you guys end up being, um, but pretty excited for the first time to come here and check it out. Thanks. Yeah, you guys are following me. I'll take you ready. Inside or outside? Outside. All right, so we're about to be seated. The building looks really cool. It looks pretty massive. So I uh, do with the club, and we have uh, this green fruit club soda uh, called Tame. We do like a little bit of that with it. It's pretty good. Okay. There's a couple drinks on the menu. Oh, wow. This is pretty cool out here. White sands again. It's pretty sweet. Oh, shit. They have tables out in the water, too. That's super dope. This is really cool. This is a lot cooler than uh, what I thought it was going to be. Thank you. That's pretty cool with the tables out there. Looks like there's a couple different bars. This place must be popping. I mean, a lot of people said it's usually packed. They had like their own like nightclub and everything. It's pretty sweet. Not gonna lie. All right, so uh, the waiter seemed pretty cool. Uh, we're gonna try out, they make some of their own uh, spirits here in a beer that sounded delicious. It was like a tropical, uh, uh, like Belgian, which is right up my fucking alley. Um, we're gonna try out some of the food here, and then uh, the view is just super cool. Great vibes. I'm sure this place pops off at night big time. So um, it was already starting to fill up a little bit, but this place is huge. This piece of land, it's massive. There's some people out there on the jet skis, but look at the, these tables are so cool out there in the water. So. Um, yeah, get hammered and do a live stream. It should be pretty fun. So for all you that are wondering about the food, we got a pizza and added Caribbean jerk on there. Good stuff. Yeah. And then we haven't tried the crab dip yet, but look at that. It looks fucking delicious. All right, so update. If any of you were watching the almost three hour stream, which was fantastic, by the way, thank you guys so much for the love. Shell lost a uh, bracelet, which was literally right here she, it was a, something special to her but we found it right it was i had to end the stream she was crying and i was like all right no 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 we find it and but we found it we good we good now no we still but we have it now no no <laughs> kissy kiss for the for the for the youtube God damn it. <laughs> boys, boys, Shell is fucking hammered. She's been yelling in and out of fucking traffic. What were you yelling about? Something. I don't know what you're talking about. Yeah, oh, now you're gonna act all, oh, okay. Let me turn the camera off here. You're a fucking asshole. 
<laughs> legitly was yelling through traffic at the top of her lungs, spitting like a fucking man. No. No? It was a skeleton. Oh. <laughs> so, <laughs> so, my, this dude over here knows how drunk she is right now. No. Right? Never she hammered. Oh, yeah, right, yeah, that's my guy. That's my fucking guy. We're best friends. We're we, already are, we already are best friends. Look. Oh. People getting tased. People getting tased. Yeah, the police academy. Oh. <laughs> my buddy just said it to me. I'm dying. Oh, second person oh shit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. You guys want to come in? Come on, it's all, we got room. No, no, they don't fuck with us. They don't fuck with us. He's, ah! I know this guy's gotta be pissing on himself. You ever been tased before? It's not fun. It's not, it's not fun. I did it for money, it wasn't fun, man. Oh, money? Yeah, oh yeah. Yeah. Have a good night. That dude knew Shell was fucking hammered. Shell's out here doing karate kicks in the goddamn lobby. And I gotta go to dinner with this. I'm the responsible one tonight, somehow. 24 hours. What? Coffee, 24 hours. So we are... I, feel like it's I raining. said that earlier. It's raining. We are going to dinner at uh, Ocean 13, and pretty excited about this because I'll be getting my first steak here in Maryland. Don't fuck my steak up. What happens when someone fucks great. my steak up? It smells great out here. It does smell good. I don't care about your steak. <laughs> okay, <laughs> so <laughs> we're at Ocean 13, which you can see the waters right there. Cool. Shelly's fucking goddamn hammered from the live stream. She just bought a $20 mask for no reason. It wasn't 20. How much was it? You told me 20. Mm, it was something else. But we're gonna see. Supposedly, this place is supposed to be good. It's on the boardwalk here in Ocean City. And, uh,. I'm gonna try the steak, man. I'm really feeling steak. I think this is gonna be my legit birthday menu or birthday choice, I should say. Uh, so we'll see how good it is, but holy good. Fuck, she's hammered. <laughs> okay, so we just got the food. People around here are cool. They're from Jersey, somewhat Jersey too, PA. I got, usually I don't do this. So this is a risotto, and this is shrimp potatoes. I had to try them, and then a ribeye. What'd you get, Shell? I got crab balls. Crab balls, yeah, crab balls. I like crab balls. Yeah. She got some crab balls. So we're gonna find out. You obviously know I'll give you an honest opinion. The steak smells delicious, though. Note to self, don't take Shelly somewhere. Get off my dick, Shelly. No, no. Get you see what's going on down here? You see you see that? Shell has dropped. They brought her out three sets of silverware. Because she's hammered. No. Alright, so for real, can you focus for a minute, drunky? The first set was because they fell over the edge. Food? No. Can we can we get serious for just one second? No. <laughs> Food. Look, Good? Is, this view is really good. Good or no? The view is great. All right, I'm done. Anyways, uh, if you're going to come and you want, the steak was decent. A little, French fries are great. Little overcooked, um, but still good. The thing that, like, blew my mind was... Um, French fries. French fries. The thing that blew my mind was the lobster mashed potatoes. Wow. Risotto was phenomenal. Very good risotto. But the lobster mashed potatoes. 
out of this world. Highly recommend this place. Pretty much on average for most of the other prices that are around here, come here for dinner. Come here for dinner. She's literally just stuck 10 fries in her mouth. <laughs> she was fucking goddamn hammered. <clears throat> good morning, good morning, good morning. It is Friday morning. Uh, feeling pretty good. Got hammered yesterday. Pretty much all day and did the live stream on Twitch, which was fucking really cool thank you guys for all the love i think i'm gonna start doing a lot more irl stuff when we go on trips uh now granted you know that lte is working great and stuff like that it's flawless we went live for like three hours and uh it's about uh i don't know eight in the morning up on the early grind gonna get a three to four mile walk in i mean just look at this to just man just be able to wake up and just I wonder how many people like take this for granted that live here you know and they don't ever do this oh my god it would be so easy for me to lose a ton of weight here <laughs> this is just gorgeous so a lot of serenity can be found here um so far everything's been great uh, minus the first day of food that we tried and I'm a big foodie so um, definitely take, take my advice. Uh, but last night's meal was extremely, extremely good. Well worth, uh, the money. Um, other than that, uh, I think today she wants to try something in the hotel for lunch. And then we've been told a lot about this sunset grill. So I think that's what we're going to do for dinner. And then tomorrow we leave and then we head off to St. Michael's and then somewhere else on the way back home. So we'll see.
Okay, uh, we're heading to dinner at the Sunset Grill. We've heard nothing but phenomenal things from local people and other people around. It's gorgeous out here. All these houses are beautiful. Um, we're expecting kind of an expensive dinner, but that's completely okay if it's worth it. So we'll see how it goes. We're meeting a couple friends here. Um, Bit lives in Rehoboth. He's the guy that I was telling you that worked at uh, Dogfish Brewing. I'm um, pretty excited to see him. Haven't seen him since our last Rehoboth trip. Into the, where the, the water is going to go. The boat has to go out quite long ago. Not that yeah. Oh, wow. <laughs> it is cool up through here. Hey, thank you. It is a pretty view, I'm assuming, since it's a little chilly. Oh no, it's okay. I'm assuming they put that up because it might be chilly or something. So we just got our food. I had to get, you guys know I have to get Wagyu whenever I can find it. So I was a little pricey, but I'm sure it's good. You got chicken Chesapeake, I right? Yeah. What's the corn stuff over there? Edamame. Oh yeah, 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 edamame. <laughs> and then scallops, lobster. Crab. What else? A little bit of crab, the cheese. Oh yeah, yeah. <laughs> And then Shelly is eating uh, chicken lettuce wraps. Yeah, really good. Yeah. So we just finished dinner. Uh, my dinner was great. The Wagyu. I'd probably skip it. Maybe go for the ribeye. Uh, the chimchurri was fantastic though. Potatoes were good. Was your chicken good? Yes, excellent. Yeah? Excellent. Very good. You had the scallops and scallops lobster. Yeah. And you didn't like the, the imperial, which... No, too Dijon-y. Yeah, this is a very dijon -y imperial. Chili, was it good? It was very that good. That chicken's fantastic, yeah. by the way. Really good. Yeah. Now we're gonna sit around for some drinks and uh, chill and chat. But uh, a cool vibe. There's so many big boats out here on the water. If there's any lights out there when we walk, I'll try to get some of it. But I would highly suggest if you want a really good, fancier meal, Sunset Grill. We just left Maryland. It was a pretty good trip. We're still in Maryland. Well, I mean, <laughs> we just left Ocean City. We're at St. Michael's right now. Um, we're gonna stop here to eat lunch at some place she wants to eat at. Looks just like a normal house. Uh, cool little town, I guess. I don't know, we haven't really seen anything. The weather's kind of crappy, so. Uh, this food better be good. Probably won't be, so we'll see. Thank you. It's a pretty cool vibe here. I didn't take the camera inside the house. That's where I went to the bathroom, but it was really sweet. It's legit old ass house, like from 1800s. I got a lobster Reuben and Shelly got ahi tuna, taco. ahi tuna tacos black and then she swears they're amazing. So I'm gonna taste and find out. The food, fantastic, good stuff. Those those shrimp ta or the uh, ahi tuna tacos were amazing. My sandwich was amazing. But if you do get any type of sandwich, ask for the spicy Cajun marmalade. Put it on a sandwich. Out of this world. I dipped it in my fries. It, into it and then end up putting it on my sandwich. It's so good. Highly recommend. What's it called again? Awful Arthur's. Awful Arthur's. Really, really cool experience. Sit outside, enjoy the scenery. It's very cool vibe. Plus, I mean, the fire's right here, so it's also cool.
That's how old school that church looks. So I'm a sucker for old architecture and cemeteries. And there's one right there. This looks like a pretty cool, it's just a whole bunch of shops, like a really, really fucking old school ass town. Goes down for a couple miles. Um, this place is pretty fucking sweet, not gonna lie. Thank you for taking the time out of your day to watch another one of my videos. I really appreciate it. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Don't forget there's a hundred other videos on this channel ranging from vlogs, best class setups, as well as some comedy.